yellow. You're yes, like the thank golden you. girl today. <laughs> yeah, I'm trying to. Beautiful. Trying to bring out this beautiful weather brings um, it out in me. <laughs> well, speaking of beautiful, what Ginger is very good at is bringing us what I consider to be these true little works of art that we can decorate, decorate so the cute. outside of our house with. This is a hand-painted metal and glass bird garden statue. This is the last day you're seeing it at the featured price. That price will be going away at the end of the day, which is really only in just a couple of hours from now. So we have two different choices for you. We've got the flamingo yes. done in the shades of pink and the jewel tone red wings right here. Love this. But Next to the so flamingo, sweet. we have just a choice that's called rainbow. Are you kidding me right I now? I know, I know. It's just beautiful. I mean, the sun isn't even shining on this. It, if we had the sun so shining pretty. on it right now, it it's would be really, magnificent. It's really, really, really pretty. The way that we've done this by XArt is we have taken metal and stamped it so that it looks like the feathers have been individually done. And then we've painted this and baked it right into the metal. It's completely treated and UV protected, so you don't have to worry about the elements. When you get this at home, the only assembly for both of them is just attaching the tail. Right. That is it. Then I'm going to turn it around because each one has the wings that are made out of glass and they have been placed on the inside. Is that and why cut they're out. so they're so magical? shimmery and magical? Because glass. Yes, because they're glass. It's so beautiful. And then the filigree body that design all the way around is just so adorable. And These are about what? 27 inches tall too, so they're gonna stake up and be nice in your garden. You could put this so inside. Cute. I know a lot oh, of yeah, people I have. put this oh, yeah, you yeah, inside or outside. I mean. And the feet, <laughs> by the way, the feet on this are so darn so cute. cute. When you come in the little shape of the feet, they <laughs> look, look like that. these little duck feet. They're so They're adorable. so cute. So what is this guy here So okay, so we us? do get a steak. So what you're gonna do is if you're gonna use this outside, you can just, you know, stake that right into the ground just to keep it from maybe toppling over. Okay. And that's pretty much it. Um, if you wanna use it inside, it is nice and flat with, you saw those feet, so it's really nice and sturdy and stable so that if you do wanna put this, um, maybe nestle it into your house plants or put it in the front entrance as mm -hmm. people are walking in to say hello and right. see you. It's, you know, this is a little bit of whimsy for your garden, a little bit of fun for your garden. It says that I'm, I'm not so uppity. I love to have fun. And, you know, I mean, pink flamingos, can what I, says more than pink can flamingos? Can I tell you a little tradition to start? Well, first of all, um, the pink flamingo is the more limited of the two options that we have. So as neighbors in our neighborhood, we started talking about this a couple of years ago at a barbecue <laughs> somebody had, and they said, why don't we, why don't we do this? more often yes how about we use a pink flamingo as the code for we're having a party at our house oh, on I Friday love that. so Friday night would be the party night and if you drive by a house in or if we drive by a house in our development and we see that flamingo out it's a sign that on Friday you know BYOB we're just gonna be outside coming around back and we're having idea. a little thing whoever can come can and whoever can't like there's no worries <laughs> that's so great you should do that with the people in your community it's so much fun oh it sounds like a blast mm -hmm. I just know so many people that collect pink flamingos and it's not just in the lower states it's all over the place they just love them yeah these are completely they're treated they're fun they're so, so whimsical fun. really and it's it's the same company XArt that brings the geeky beak birds mm -hmm. and um you is know, that a peacock planters. I don't believe the peacock is still available right just to let you know that's all. right mm -hmm. um we did have it but he he just flew out of here so quick <laughs> <laughs> so the pink flamingo is adorable the only assembly really is just to attach that bottom tail and you can stake this into the ground. If you have any sort Love of uh, areas that you want to nestle them into, they're great. They're 27 inches tall um, with their little headdress that's at the very top. They're made out of a treated metal. They're UV protected that's too. Great. And they're made out of glass as well. The wings on them are uh, treated glass that have been hand painted. As a matter of fact, you can kind so of see them wiggling around a little bit. Yeah, they they're are on springs. On springs so yeah, if so it makes it so much fun. By, there is that bit of wiggling here, and mm -hmm. I have to say this rainbow choice, is so the pretty. coloring Isn't on the gorgeous? tail feathers, it almost looks like a macaw in the tail feather coloring, but it's obviously not a macaw in the actual bird, but those are the colors that I think of when I think of a rainbow macaw right here. And then the crest on the rainbow choice yes. is just a little bit higher right. and different. And that's what I like about this. They're not just exactly the same with different colors. They truly are, they are different very birds. different. It, even the beaks The beak, on them, it's all different. They're completely different on each one of them. You can see the attention to detail on mm -hmm. the head. Um, you know, you were talking about that. I mean, just, I love the color choices that we've done for each one of them and how we've kind of done the body in the filigree design, but the metal and um, 
the glass that mm -hmm. has been painted on and each all treated one of them so it'll so stay beautiful. looking good outside yes. but don't be afraid to bring it in if you would like and, and I I mean I, I every time that I have mine nestled into you know just kind of had just kind of peeking out just a little bit with right. my house plants and I get people coming into the house and you know I entertain all the time so mm -hmm. they come in and they and they just do a double take and they just laugh because it's so darling it is so darling and all the kids love them you know they're just so sweet they're fabulous so price twenty seven dollars and ninety eight cents you couldn't even touch something like this in oh, many of your garden true. stores, the price would be outrageous. So true. But that price is going away at the end of the day in just a couple of hours. So M49579, if you want to check this one out, use the number that pops up if you're going to place your order by phone at the bottom of the screen. Um, and you're going to be back yes. because we will be chatting about, uh, we will be chatting about birds. <laughs> and these two beautiful pieces that we have right here, we've got an apple or a pear choice. And that is M51821, if you just can't wait. All right. You are joining us for probably one.